Hello there and welcome to the Paper Haven. My name is Julie Sutcliffe and I'm a Stamping Up demonstrator and I'm in the UK. And today I wanted to share with you the papers from this mini catalogue, which actually goes live on Tuesday the... No, it doesn't. It goes live on Wednesday the 4th of September. However... It will be live, hopefully, around 11pm on the Tuesday the 3rd. Um, but technically, it is the 4th of September. Um, so, I am doing a paper share. And I've sold three already. So, thank you to my customers who have purchased that, pre-ordered that. And I'm going to go through what you get in the paper share. And I'm going to show you the paper. So, you can see them in a little bit more detail. I'll give you a little bit of information about it. So, you know, have a cup of... I love paper. Um, so, yeah, stick with me. It won't be too long a video, I wouldn't have thought. But um, if you have any questions, then just pop them in the comments and I'll get back to you. <clears throat> so, um, six of the sets of paper are 12 by 12, two are 6 by 6, which I'll share in a moment. And in the paper share, um, basically, you're going to get a quarter of a pack of each of the papers. So when it comes to the six by six, they will just come as six by six pieces. When it comes to these, they will come as a six by 12 piece. Now I have had one lovely customer who's purchased two paper shares. Um, and that means she's gonna get like a full, she's gonna get half a pack basically and like a full sheet. Okay, so um, these ones, I'll just have to keep referring to my catalogue these are actually part of our making a difference program and these are called sentimental christmas and um two pounds fifty for every purchase of these will go to a uh, charity and i think after where have i just read it's a children's charity and it's um benefiting children's literacy okay so these are in my opinion quite oh, i love that one quite 70s in feel and design um hence the sentimental this is the first time i've opened these so genuine reactions the colors in these are let me just get to the correct page because they are shown twice in the catalog they're shown right near the beginning where it tells you about the charity and then there is a product suite that they're in. So the colours are, oh, actually, I'll tell you what. Oh, Poppy Parade, Old Olive, Shaded Spruce, Pretty Peacock, Pecan Pie and Basic Beige. Oh, I love that one. I love that one. Proper Christmas trees, and that's nice. Proper Christmas trees. So they've got that old fashioned. Oh, look at that. Now, we're to, all I've seen to talk about is scrapbooking this week. And if ever that was going to be a scrapbook page, that's the one. That's lovely, too. Another stripe. And finally, oh, candles. Oh, and look, another scrapbook page. Fabulous. Okay, so they are the Sentimental Christmas. So you get a quarter of a pack of those. Then we come to the elegant ones. They're called, the papers are called Season of Elegance. Now these are a speciality one. So they've got a uh, gold foil on one side. So the colours in here. Uh, old Olive, Mossy Meadow, Pretty Peacock, Cherry Cobbler, Basic Beige, and your Gold. So these are very sophisticated papers. On the other side, they've just like got a non-gold. So if you like classy, then these are for you. Really nice to make some simple cards. and gift wrap and things like that, little gift box. And they are a lovely weight. The 
there seems to be loads of them actually but it's 12 sheets there and that's the other side so yeah they are the elegance season of elegance okay then i'm moving on to some that are non-christmas these ones are called regal winter okay so colors in here are cherry cobbler wild wheat pretty peacock knight of navy blackberry bliss and berry burst very regal and opulent very dark um but look at those these look nice cut up and made into card designs just with a greeting so any of those coffee and cards that i've done in the past where i've sort of cut the papers up into threes or do you remember that one where we did the stack cut and shuffle that would look great with these some wild wheat on the other side there we go i think the top one's my favorite in those that one so these ones that i've shared with you so far i'm not doing any classes with those ones um i'm just going to move this to one side because what i wanted to do is do it in order of um well i wanted to share the ones that i'm not doing a class with so I've not planned anything with those three that I've just shared with you. Now, these are the six by six. These are called Take a Bow. And these are Garden Green, Granny Apple Green and Real Red. So only three colours in here and you get a lot. Now, these work with that new dye. We've got a dye that's coming out that um, makes those lovely paper bows. So it could be Take a Bow or Take a Bow. Oh, I love that spotty one. You know me and my spots. I love spotty papers. So these are really nice. Nice. Um, oh, and another spotty. I do love those. Really nice. So you'll get, there's 48 in there, so you'll get 12 of those in the paper share. And then another six by six. We tend to do this sort of design every time now and this one is called splendid autumn and i know i've got a few customers who would love these I have done a stamper stack with designs like this in the past but i just don't think i'm gonna have time to fit it in so what i would suggest is if you want to order them with me go back and watch my previous a christmas stamper stack and another one where i use the meandering meadows and you'll be able to do the similar designs. So these are lovely, gorgeous autumnal colours. Colours in here are Cherry Cobble, Cajun Craze, Wild Wheat, Mossy Meadow and Moody Mauve. Oh, look at that one. We had a sky like that, a bit like that last night, actually. That's lovely, that one. Wow. Oh, look at that one. I think people are going to love these. I'm not showing you the backs because the backs are just sort of, they're not as pretty. Oh, that's a lovely one. If you love sunflowers, that's a nice one. I like sunflowers, those. Lovely autumn tree. It's a bit of a moody one. Nice. And then we've got a wheat one. So, yep, they're included. So you'll get one sheet of each of those patterns. And then moving on to the papers, excuse me, that I'm including in classes. So these are called Snowy Wonder, I think. No, Snowy Scenes. It's a stamp set that's Snowy Wonder, honestly. It, it confuses me when I get different names. So just a heads up. These are the papers I'm using for the next coffee and card start in, in October. Bookings are open now. It's round 43. The colours in here are Poppy Parade, Petal Pink, Pumpkin Pie, Garden Green, Pool Party and Early Espresso. And these are fun. Fun and whimsical. 
Look at that. I love a house paper. And I really love this check. It's like drawn by hand almost. I love the snowmen on the other side. I've got a few penguin fans in my customer base, so I think those will go down well. And then we've got a nice holly one shown on another house. Stripe and the holly, and that's those. So I've gone through the colours on those. So that's coffee and card round 43. And then this one, these are called Nests of Winter. And this is what I'm using for my festive treat day. And I've chosen these because it's a festive treat day. It doesn't say Christmas, so it's more a wintery one. So I decided to use these papers. Now these are gorgeous for putting on cards. And um, this is a real treat day and it, I've had two bookings so far and um, we do gorgeous projects. We're going to do a 3D item, we're going to do a lovely frame and it includes three stamp sets does the treat day and it's on the 2nd of November. This is my favourite paper, I love that one. So there we go. And then the other side. So you've got like birds and things on one side. And then like a more geometric pattern on the other side. So they're gorgeous. And then finally in the paper share, we have reindeer days. Now I apologize because I've used these for my team night on um Tuesday so I've only got half a pack left but I'll still be able to show you both sides of the paper but as a bonus I can actually show you um, some projects I've made and these are the papers I'll be including in my paper crafts and piano day which we do really need some more bookings for it's on the 12th of October so these are really nice I love this one So if you want to take part in the paper share, I will put a link in the description of the video and it's £24.50 plus postage. Or if you live local, you can come and collect. So this is just half of the pack to show you, but I will show you the projects. These are called Reindeer Days. So I'll show you some cards that I've made with them. So a really easy card was this one. Just showing off the papers. These aren't particularly what we make at Paper Crafts and Piano, although a couple of them might make the grade. There's one with that gorgeous embossing folder that I love. And then I was really pleased with this one. The stamps here are from a new stamp set called Peaceful Season, which is actually included in the festive treat day. And this one is using the hexagon punch. Now watch out, I'm going to be popping a class on this weekend for World Card Making Day. And uh, it's going to be a class based around this hexagon punch. So do look out for that. And I think that's all that I have to share with you for the paper share. Um, if you have any questions, please do leave me a comment and I will get back to you or drop me a, an email. My email is in the description and um, hope you'll join my paper share and I'll see you soon. Bye.